Okay, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Evening. I'm very happy, very, I'm very happy, very glad to be uh, this evening in front of my brother and sister, African American from the US to Africa, like exactly in Senegal. Mm -hmm. And it makes me a big pleasure to be in front of you and to let you know about myself, about uh, the net ne network system in, in my country. So, Bomani, Bomani's group, I say hello to you again. I say hello to my brother Usman. We belong to this country and we bring the same brotherhood, which is like a Murid brotherhood from Tuba. He's very, he's a kind man and I know him long time ago. And uh, and uh, anybody is with, he, he give, give you good knowledge, him also. I know him, he's a big guy, Usman. And I used to have my groups coming every time, doing tours about Korea Island and we meet together. And uh, I know he's a gentleman. So I'm very happy, very glad to be here in front of you. Yes. In front of his group and try to let you know about myself and about the uh, uh, system of working with in, exactly in Senegal. You know, Senegal is one of the uh, West African countries. So, West Africa is a little bit different to South Africa or to East Africa because our country are colonized, were colonized by French from 1651. So, that means we have three centuries of colonization with the French people. So we can, we already copied a lot of things from them, of course, but business. But why time was going and why we are independently free from them, we start doing our own business by ourselves. And I think it's normal. And uh, since you are back home here for pilgrimage, we have to let you know because we don't want, for example, folks people come back here and get what we, ha what we have to do for you, they can do it for you. And that's not good because the money go back to Europe. But if you do business with your Senegalese local people, the money spent stay in your country, which is your motherland. Yes. Yes. Now, I'm here in front of you, talking to you, but I don't know if you get the same blood. You might be my blood brother. You might be Usman's blood brother. We never know how, how they destroyed African people, like the past of a time. How they took slaves from here back to U.S., West Indies, Brazil. So if, if you meet you as a brother, we can consider you as a real brother and real sister. That's why I'm very happy to talk to you. How I'm going to talk to you is different like how I'm talking to European people. Because I'm a tour guy, I'm a storyteller, you know, I'm a translator. I'm working with most different nationalities from Europe and from states like black, like you. But, but what, 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 what I'm telling you is different to what I'm telling them right. in, in some ways. Because you are here for some reason. Then maybe they are here for relaxing, for the sun. For tourism, but you are here for pilgrimage. You need to learn, you need to know your African continents. Because history has been changed by them. For example, one time one African American black lady asked me, Why you why you sold us to US as slaves? I asked her, I said, Who told you that? She said, I read that in the book. I read that our ancestor sold our ancestors to be into slaves. I sit down with her, I talked to her, finally she understood. I told you that, be careful. Sometimes history has been changed by them. Mm -hmm. Because they have been forced, our ancestor, to sell their own brother. Mm -hmm. Guess that you be in the village. You put them guns, they don't know, they don't know anything. You tell them, send me your brother or your sister, otherwise I kill you. That's true. They have been forced, but they, they didn't write that in books. They changed the history. That's why you should come, mm -hmm. meet someone like Osman, someone like me, will tell you the truth. Even in business, in business network, is the same thing. Banking, citizen things, you know what I mean? Counting, buying land, everything. You should meet the real people that let you know because some of these banks are owned by them. They're behind the banks. I don't know if you understand my point. You know what I mean? They, they support money, open their own bank in Africa. And in, in other way, they want you to put, to put your money and one part with them will go to them. They have a lot of banks over here owned by the European. They have a lot of companies owned by the European. Like wood, wood, wood company, cloth company, cars company, industry company. Like the French, they own a lot of things over here. I can say like maybe 60% or 70% of our economy is based on them. Because they colonized my country for 300 years. They have a lot of interest over here. So wherever you go in Africa, any country you go owned by French, if something happened, like country burnings, boys striking, students burning street and everything, 
they come quickly to preserve their things because they know they have something here. That's why if you start doing business in, our, in my country, in any company, you need to know which bank you have to open your account. Oh, really? Yes. Because mm -hmm. some banks, they took most part of the money. Some banks, the money stay over here. That's why you should get all the information clear, open business here. To have a citizen purpose here. You know what I mean? Okay. To start doing business in most of the African country. <clears throat> they might be colonized by English, French, Spanish, Italian, because don't forget that Africa had been, had been shared by the European in 1885. They share Africa. Italian went to East Africa, French went to West Africa, English went to South Africa. They share Africa totally, completely shared. Now, from 1960 to now, most of the Af African countries owned by French get independence. But some English countries get independence later. But some get independence sooner before us. Like South Africa, Zimbabwe, those countries, they get independence sooner than Senegal. But we get independence earlier than Gambia, for example. Gambia get independence in 1965. Like five years later after us. So yes, so some bank in the Gambia are owned by English people who colonized them. Now, for example, to give you a small example about owning lands in my country. If you want to buy a land to make your own buildings, sometimes we prefer to go to our local people owning farming ground. They used to have some farming ground, be farms ground. They used to be farmers. Now, those farming ground will be transformed to land for selling the people. For example, Dakar is very full right now. We're going to go outside of Dakar to buy some land to make a house for our family. Now, I prefer to go to see Usman, who was owning land. We talked together, me on, and him. He sent me one part, like maybe 300, uh, 300 square meters land that I can buy from him cheaper than to the big company. And after, I'm gonna find my own guy building my house. That I'm gonna pay him separately. If not, you have some promoters, like marketing people that went inside, buy all those land wholesale price, and sell it part by part. Right. But if you go directly to see Usman, you can talk with Usman. You can sell it, for example, the land for like, for example, thousand dollars. You talk together, like three square, three hundred square meters or five hundred square meters. But if you go to an, another big promoter, he will sell you double that Usman is selling you, mm. like two thousand, because he has interest in some of the bank owned by the European that work together with them. Like, for example, my house. When my father died, you know, in Africa, when your father died, we share everything. Almost after six, six months, we called all the family. We said, okay, now the father died a few months ago. We are going to share everything. But mostly the men are having more than the women when we, when we share things of the fathers. Like the house, we're going to sell it. The money we sell it, we share between the ladies and the men. But the men are having more, double than the women. Can you ask questions? Yeah. Why is, why is yeah. that? Because in America, the women would have a problem with that. But here, no. Here, it's why, different. Yeah, why is that like that? Because the men are controlling most of things in Africa. In speaking about cultural things and religious things, men are over women here in my country. And that's not from us. That's from the Islam we belong to because we are Muslim. Yes, yes, it's my right. I have like a good answer. I have a good answer on that. The fact is, like, women get married, and women are supposed to get take care of as a queen. Mm -hmm. All right? And most likely, she got more things than a man right. in the Islam world. Mm -hmm. Look at the chapter 4 of the Quran, you'll understand probably. Like, Maybe even the Bible. Yes, and I know. Yeah. Okay. When a woman marries, it's she right. surrenders her name. It's right. right. And takes on the name of okay. another Take family. Another name. Okay. The man is still like, you know, carrying the stars. Yes, like, because when, after my father died, the day we were sharing the things owned by my father, he died like 15 years ago. No feminist movement in, the, in Senegal. What does that mean? Of course. I just, Asking questions. Stop stirring the pot. <laughs> let, me, let, let me, I come back to you, man. I come back to you. Let me finish. I was, yes, I was on the move. Okay. So when my father died, 
He died 15 years ago. But one year after he died, we all sit down, the family sit down and try to share the things owned by, by my father. Now, when they give me my money, instead of going to see a big guy, I went to the village to see a chief of the village. Okay. I sat down with him, I explained to him what I just told you, and he understood me. He walked with me in the farming ground and told me, this is my, this is my land. If you want, I sell you any part you want from here. He sold me one part, like 200 square meters, right, for good price. Mm -hmm. Now, when I bought that land, my grandfather, my, my, my great brother, wanted to get the same thing like me. He came to the same village, I introduced him to the chief of the village, he bought land like me. So that means the guy is having benefit, he's getting money. Because another member of my family is getting to get something like me. But if you went to another promoter, he would sell us land, he would sell us land double price, and we'll have plenty of money to build it. Because when you buy the land, you gotta find somebody to make, to make the house. And you gotta pay him more money. Right. Now, my sisters, you know Senegalese women, they like money just to buy like goods or merchandise to sell. Or they, do, they go to Dubai or to buy something. Me, I bought my land in preserve. Preserve my land in case that my, my kids grow, I, I need to put them somewhere. But my sisters, they spend their money quickly. One of them went to Dubai, one of them went to Sandaga Market, open one shop, one of them went and they spoil their money. But me now, I get my land, and if I have money, I will build my house, and my family will be there. And then, in exchange, they will go and rent, rent apartments or rooms in somebody's house. While me, I'm getting my house. Because I went to the village. I don't mind about living somewhere far. Maybe them, they didn't want to go somewhere far. Because if you buy land over there, it's cheaper than if, if you buy land in the city. Like for example, this is the cost side. Land is very expensive here. Whatever land costs here, it costs over there maybe 10, 000, 10, 10 times less, for example. Because that's, that, that's in land. You further out in the country. No further out, let's, let's say maybe to where, to where they're selling us land now is about not far from where you went today, not far from the Pink Lake, that area. They're selling land over there. Those, those houses you were seeing not finished? Yeah. Those houses are bought by someone, maybe they stop making because of financial they problems, have. maybe money. Mm -hmm. okay. Now, if you go there with Usman, Usman can find your land quickly, they sell you. But now, when they sell you the land, you don't have to build it quickly, build it quickly. You have to go to the headquarters of the mayor office of that area. They have to stamp, you know, the stamp of the mayor officer to make sure that you get land from the area. <clears throat> After that, you have to pay some cautions again if you want you can talk with the guy say that i have my lawyer i want my lawyer to see what we signed together but mostly those things are between the chief and you mm -hmm. but anytime problem will happen you have to pay back again what you didn't pay before you have to find a lawyer you have to go to the domain system like the people technically of the area office working for the government they control everything so that's why it happens sometimes you see somebody who can sell land to two people. I have my own land. If I'm, if, if I'm a bad man, I sell one to you and I sell the same land to him. Like if you're ready to build, he's ready to build, you join together. So that things make troubles. That's why you have to go negotiate with the right guy to meet in the villages. Now, about banking system in my country. It's very important. Any bank you would like to go now to open an account, for example, they will ask you your ID card number. If you are foreigner, they ask you your passport number with three different small photo size passport or size ID. They need to know if you foreigners, they control, the, they need to know the country you're from. You let them, you let them know about your crime Labor and everything before you open any account, banking account in my country. But we have some local banks that, if I know somebody like a VIP in that bank, I go straight to his office. I can deal directly with him. I bring my ID card, my photos, they give me one paper to fill out. I tell him, I want to get 
and account, bank account here. But it's different about which bank account you want. We have different ones. You have some account that you just keep your money. Then you can take it anytime you want. You have some commercial, trade business account. You know, companies account, everything. It depends about the purpose you want. They give to you and you can fill out. But mostly, if you are foreigners, you go through your embassy. They'll give you all the information you need before you open any, any, any account in any bank because they don't know, they don't know if things will be happen again between you and them, or maybe in the future. That's why the black African Americans, I know that they open here business. They went through the embassy. The embassy will let them know about all the papers they did apply before they go before they go to any bank because. Business are different. You can you can you can be in you can do business in agriculture in my country like like uh, rice crops, vegetables, fruits, cotton, everything. You can be into fishing company if you want. We have a lot of fishing company around the coast side of Dakar. You have any other fishing company in the other place where we have fishing coast like in Jawal, in Embur, and many places. Even if, if you open your own company, also you have to go through your through your embassy because you have to pay a lot of tax. Mm -hmm. And the incoming tax system in my country are different. The Senegalese, the local people are paying cheaper than the foreigners. Now, in Africa, our problem is like the main problem we have is like the governments we have, the leaders are getting all things for them. Like anytime they. They, 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 you elected as a president, you call your people, your brother, you know what I mean? Your cousin, no. your friend, you give them some deal markets, right? So those who don't know the, the president, you have to go through the real ways to get some papers to be businessmen. And that costs you money. That costs you a lot of money. But if you're related to the president, or you, if you know somebody who knows the president, or who knows the minister or VIP, you, Quickly, you get the things that they need, and you can do you can do business. Like for example, me and Usman, we are tour guide. For example, the tourist company, the IRS are the guide. We are the one going through with the with the, with the tourists, with the foreigners like you in the bus talking. So we have the ID card between you and the government and our country. We let you know about what happened in Senegal. The director of the company. You never sit, you never stand up in the bus and talking with the tourists. You never they don't know Senegal. And it's getting it's getting all the money and pay us money to go on tours. That means we are doing the job and then they stay in the office with the AC, nice car, everything, and we are the one going and risking with the people through the land. So they, they didn't pay us the right money they should pay us then. Because behind you have big boss. And behind the big boss, it can be a European French guy. A lot of companies here are doing the same thing. So, that's why we want to do our own things by ourselves now. Mm -hmm. We know how to book hotels. We know how to book restaurants. We are tour guide. We're speaking different languages. We know how to do that. So why, why don't we do business straight with you, for example, from US? You can deal with Osman directly. You can deal with me. So we have money, all the money stay together with us. In a circle, yeah. Yes. So, I remember, I had a group of African American black, we went on, we went touring. The last day, they asked me who owned the company. Mm -hmm. I should tell them the truth. I was working with a company named Fram, Fram. But Fram is owned by European French people. And when I told them Fram, they were mad. Mm -hmm. Because they thought that from the US, they let them know that the company owned by Senegalese. Yes, and when they came here, the company wasn't owned by Senegalese. Like, I talked to them, I talked to them, I convinced them. Okay, and after, they're all right. That's why now all the African American black I know want to come to Senegal through the Senegalese people. Because right. as I say, whatever you spend, even a drink, if you spend a drink, the money stay in the country. Now, we are car companies, cars, bus companies. We have leather companies wooden companies, iron, and they discover petrol and gas in my country. That's our main big problem now. A lot of Europeans will come here after this COVID system happening, they will come because they already signed contract.
with the government about extracting petrol from the ground in my country. That's why they start buying land, making some buildings. But on those buildings, under the name of Senegalese people, they know. They don't want we know them, we know that that's their building. They're coming now. French, Spanish, Italian. Even Americans, they come, they start coming because it's sure we know that Senegal get petrol and gas. Even us in the country now, people are fighting to become president one day of the republic because they know that Senegal will be richer on the future coming. That's why African American uh, African Americans should come also to West Africa and particularly to Senegal. If you if you, if your business is in petrol, you can start coming now, asking contract, seeing people, go in the company, see what they do, get papers to apply. You know what I mean? If you work in petrol, because they will come. Can African Americans participate in the politics of the nation? No, not in the politics, because you have, to, like I said, you have to get the linking man, linking person between you and the government. So things will be easy. Like Usman can know someone and take it to him, you talk to him about. What if once an, Amer an African American um, gets citizenship in, in Senegal? Can he then participate in the politics of the nation? Or if you become Senegalese, of course, but you have double nationality. That happens sometimes. Right. You are, you are, you, you are Ameri African American and you Senegalese. Yeah. But I'm not sure is if quickly you'll run on the election. That's my problem. You have to you have to go in different steps to be president because Senegal is one of the first country owned by French people in Africa. We have we have talented yeah, people I, here I, in my country. Any African American that took on citizenship and would have to surrender his American citizenship. Yeah. to be fully embedded in the nation of his, of his adopted country. Because before to be president in my country, you have to be totally Senegalese, all yeah. your papers. Right. Like, you're born over like 1960, you have to be Senegalese, you have to be correct, they see your papers, your past history. If you didn't put no crime system, if, you, if, if you're clear, everything happened to you before, they, before you participate, and you have to pay caution, a lot of money. Yeah. Here, I think they pay 25 million CFA. How much is Usman in, in dollars? 25 million. 25 million, 25 million is about like 50,000 US. Yeah, that's what, that's, that's what they give to be candidate. But your background is vetted. Yes, yeah, of Senegalese course. System no. Or in a fall. No, I think Senegalese. They want everything to be Senegalese. Probably uh, connected. I'm interested in the investment part. Yeah, that's what yes. I'm interested in the investment. But 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 if you really really talk, if you really talk in the West South, that was only okay. Right now, there's one country in Africa that is really independent, really really independent is Rwanda. Rwanda. Mm -hmm. Rwanda. Oh, I don't I mean, because he don't play. He don't play. He don't play. He don't yeah. give nobody nothing. They stole the diamond from Burundi. They pass on his country. They say, give me my part. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. And everybody have to clean the country to have paper. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Even if you want to have like documents, you have to clean. You have to clean up the country. It's the oh, most yeah. clean country in in the world right now. They even mm -hmm. like working with Dubai. Yeah, no, they, right? they, they I don't know about it. They moved ahead. The, 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 the last thing that we had was yeah. trying to unite Africa. Was this man Muammar Gaddafi? They mm. killed him. Thomas yeah. Sankara. They killed him. They killed him. We are dependent in one fact because uh, the diameter of our knowledge has been given by these white people. That's why they can control the circumference of all people activities. Yes. And government are the ones that rule countries. You got the point? Government are people that rule countries. Right. Now, if I, if you give me the diamond of my knowledge and I accept to push it to people of your country, the old people, you destroy your people. Yes. You will sell your land, you will sell your sisters, you will sell your brother because it's about like just what we wrote about the dollar in God we trust. Okay, in God we trust is right. But between you and I, yeah. <laughs> yes. Now, like for example, for example, what uh, according to what this man said, you know we have petrol in my country. Now the president who is here now, he want he want he want to rule for 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 third mandate, like third third position mandate for him. Say that again. And he should do two. He only wants to do two. Times. You know he was he was elected like uh, in 2012. And he's up for no. He's trying to get it, another. He's, he's, he's running he in, the, in the second time. He, he wants the third one. He wants to have another. Yeah, because because, because they found all because they found and they already signed some money coming in. Oh wow! Oh, I got you. Now, 
how to obtain a residence permit in Senegal. We have Senegalese residency permit. First, you should write a letter. The letter will be directed to the Minister of Interior, like controlling the police, the justice, you know, and the security of the country. The letter will go with your ID card copy or your passport copy with the three different photos, right? And the letter should specify that it is a residency application. It should be signed it and should include a phone number also from the country you're from, okay? But the, the, the paper's gonna buy, pass over from office to office with different signatures to make sure that. Can I ask you this? Have they stopped building on, uh, building on the pipeline? Who's gonna bring it? Who's gonna bring it all up and bring it into the refinery? Yes. Pipeline up. Yeah. Who's gonna bring it from the, the, the ground? Is in it? Wait, let me ask you this: Is it offshore? Or onshore? It's no, offshore. offshore. It's offshore. Yes, but they say that it might be one shore one day after the offshore. I, I know your question. The ones who are coming to extract the petrol, depending to the contract they sign against, uh, they sign with all French, either Americans, either Italian or Spanish, or Turkish people. Turkish. The Turkish, Turkish they're very powerful. Yeah. I think they're in the first position now, the Turkish, after we get the French and the Italian. But Americans will come. I heard that with Biden. When Biden came, no, no, listen. No, they will come. It's all. Okay, let me continue. They're here. Now. Of course they'll be here. They'll be here. Okay. Senegal is residency permits. You need to have a copy of your birth certificate certified by a local gendarmerie, like a local police at this thing, right? Provide by the consular section, which costs like 50 franc equivalent. You can also schedule a notary appointment for his document here in my country. This is for a contract? Yeah, for a contract, but you have to get the res uh, Senegalese residency permit first if you want to be Senegalese. You, you need to get the permit to be Senegalese. And after you go, find papers, so your, your residency papers will be clear for you to be Senegalese. Do you have any sen uh, Senegal contract? The contract will come after, but first get the papers. Your papers should be legal, you know what I mean? But this is very important, look like this, what, what they say. A copy of your birth certificate certified by a local gendarmerie. Mm. Because they will check behind you what happened to you before in the US. Mm. About crime, drugs, yeah. Yeah. drugs, or maybe something crazy you put over there in your life one day. Yeah. They want to see how good Yes, yeah. I want to see. It's like a background. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, and they say that the consular sec section would cost you like 50 francs. So you can schedule a notary appointment with this document here. Copy of the first five page of your passport. Please make sure the, the entry stamp is well seen on your passport. They want to know when you got here. You know what I mean? When you, when you left the US. No, your embassy will be, you go through your embassy. They, 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 you, they will see your passport and they will let them know. Oh. Okay. But work contract of one year legalized by Senegal's level inspection. You need to go to Senegal's level mm -hmm. inspection. We call it inspection de travail. If you take the paper over there, they give you eight days or 46 days that you have to go back there. They stamp it again and give you your paper. The paper now will authorize you that you get a Senegalese permit citizen premium in Senegal. Now, after you get that, you have to go through the company, try to get appointment, and you will tell them what kind of business you're doing. Agriculture, family grounds, car companies, investment, banking, and everything. They need to know. This is what you have to do first if you just want to Yes, because after you have to go to the Chamber of Commerce, which is where people are registered themselves to do business. They call it the Chamber of Commerce. It's a big trade, trade office in my country that people go there, make line, one by one they give you papers and you tell them what you want. We call that the Chamber of Commerce in my country. It's a tra trade point place, you know? Yeah. We have that too. Yes. If you plan to work in Senegal, work contract of one year legalized by Senegal's labor, located in Plateau, 
next to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Company started articles of association and letter of employment provided by your company. Trades people can provide their register import export merchant card. After you get a certificate of residence, letter of accommodation from the person who you will talk in the ministry. And you need also medical certificate from any health center you want to go. For example, if I, if I know a health center or if I know a hospital, I take you there, they make you some analyze, blood, blood analyze, blood test, everything to make sure you're okay. You don't have no disease, you know, and you well before you start doing any business here. Really? Medical certificate from a local general practitioner. There is a list of local practitioners who can provide the certificate. It should cost you like 20,000 CFA, which is like 34 US dollars. Now, after submitting of all of the above to the police, there's a tranche located in Ali Ababakarsi, next to the Commissioner of Police, Jepol, you should receive another, another certificate to make sure you, you're okay in your spirit, your head. <laughs> like you never have problem. Mm -hmm. You mentally sound. Yes, like, like you never be in the hospital that they, they, right. they check your head, that everything is normal from you. Right. Because we don't want you to sign this signature here, and you go to sign another signature different. Mm -hmm. So you might have problem one day in, in your, with your customers. They need to check your head if everything is okay. All right? But like, but like Usman said this now, people are, people are like, like snake. You know what I mean? Yeah. Instead of going to, to the true way, they go by somebody, give money, corruption, and get what they want. True. That's, that's make us late. You should go to the right way to get the, the right things you want. Right people. Yeah. Well, that's, that's, that's all over. That's Usman can be in the right way. Yeah. I come, I give two million Tifa, I go over Usman. Like he was first than me. If I give money, it's, it's back. I go in front. That's not normal. We don't like that. Yeah. Corruption with the, is the most dangerous things we are surviving in Africa right now. Corruption in all the country you go. In yes. all the country you go. True. Police on the street. Custom on the street. Gendarme on the street. Office people, officer working. Government people. Everywhere money. So, and now, we have a lot of people in my country doing their own things by themselves. And they get more money than the people working in the government. Like, I know some people, you know what they're selling? Spare parts of cars. They get million, million dollars per year. Yes, they said they spare, spare parts. Yes, Engineers, wheels, light, cups, and everything. They get big place where they, people come to buy from them and resell. Osman knows them. They get more money than the people working in the government. We know some people are selling fabrics, get big stores, but those are informal <coughs> business, not the formal one, official one from the government. They do their own thing by themselves. They travel, bring some containers, open their shops, and selling things. Of course, they have to find somebody, somebody who went to school, who can sign, who can use the computer. Them, they never been to school. Never. They even don't know how to write their names. And they get billion, 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 billion dollars here. Ask Kuzma, he knows. Transportation people using local buses. They never been to school. All their life was driving. They get some money, open their own company, get some cars, rent them, get some buses, find a driver, find somebody collecting money, and do transportation things, and they get money. Of course, they should pay, they pay some tax commission right now to the government, but they, they own things. Well, let me ask you this. What's the biggest need in, in, in Dakar? Okay, to what I know, people are different. My mind, 
should be different to Usman mine or somebody mine. For me, since the future, the future is getting interesting about this petrol and gas happening, people will come. If you have a big hotel, okay. big restaurants, tourism. big car companies, tourism, and get good translators, you, you're going to get a lot of money here. Translators? Yes. Really? Yes, from, because... From French to English? Yes, English? English to French, French to English, English to the local language, because a lot of foreigners will be here. Even now, during the COVID system, I see some guys like me, some interpreter. Mm -hmm. They work in their house with a computer. Really? They get forty-five dollars per, per day to the company in the U.S., in Holland, in Germany. Mm -hmm. They apply themselves in the company in their computer. Mm -hmm. They see translation company. You see, in all languages, they they work in their house. They still have infrastructure projects. Though. So it's the, that's more. Um lucrative with from French to English, English to French, yes. or the other languages as well. No, there are other ones too. That's what we call working online right now. Like, like they send you your money in your bank account, right? Or they can send you money from Western Union or from any, 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 any ways that you're going to get your money. I see that they're working here because last March, since now, some people are not, no, a lot of people are not working. Like one year, no job. Like us, we're tour guide. That's true. If tourists don't come, we don't, we don't have a job. We stay at home. Now, instead of staying without doing nothing, I can job in, I can work in my computer and do translation to, to the company. It depends about how I apply, you know, and which company take me according to my resume. I'm going to send them. They need my resume. Mm -hmm. They need me to tell them which school I step up. My certificate, my qualification, everything. Now, as a guy, they gave us last April 500,000 CIFA, the government. And somebody told me that we should have had 4 million per guy. 4 million CIFAs per guy. And they give us one third of that part as help for this COVID happening. And the tour guide in Morocco, they give them 5 million CIFA. Mm. Tunisia, 5 million CIFA. Senegal, they give us 500,000. They're Muslim too, though, right? No, they're Muslim, but the government they give them more money than what they give us here. Why? I don't know. That's, that's the question. Where is no, the, where's, what, Let me ask you this. What, got, what, what part of the... I'm back on the gas, you know. What, is it here, or is it another part of the country on, on the offshore? No, no. Is it further down the road? No, further down, further down the ocean. Down. I know what you mean. Not, not in the coast side. Yeah. They said further down the ocean, not here. No, that's that's the ocean who got explored. That's the ocean who got explored. They see fourteen point that everything that got got gas and oil, even the mainland have a lot of oil. So the one that they explore right now. Uh, they don't want people they're still see, looking for more. The they, they, found some, they found some. They yeah. found some. They think it's more. Yes, the tank is more. Yeah, it's one hundred kilometers. It's one hundred kilometers from the sea. Um, from, from, from the sea river. Yes. The first one. The other one is two hundred and thirty kilometers deep sea. Yeah, right. Yeah. But they have calculated it's twenty-five and million meters. Meet, 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 okay, meet, twenty-five million meters that they have. Mm -hmm. Billion meter what they, they found already. Listen, in untapped. the United States, yeah. Untapped. Yep. been touched. Yep. Untouched. Just sitting there. Untouched. Yes. <coughs> untouched. But for you to get more information, like I say, you have to come back for a special trip for that. You take your time because some Africans, sometimes they don't tell you the truth. You need to come here and see. Well, that's why I'm here. Even if they, even if they show you papers, you have some proof, yeah. things that you should go through your, your embassy. To make sure that um, I know that company will be open here, new company, I'm sure. Okay. But they, they already said that. I heard some people say that they, they're coming. Right? Okay. I have a friend of mine working in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs in, 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 in Dakar. Yeah. He, he has seen the list of the country we're going to send the people coming to Senegal. Hmm. Now we're afraid about that. We're afraid because any country get petrol and gas, sometimes people are fighting. 
Well, I ain't start killing. Yes. How many how many uh, of the ships in the port are owned by single ladies? Oh, uh, I can't tell you. I cannot okay. tell you exactly the number. It's very hard to tell. You. I didn't see how many boats. We how, how many ships? Ships? How many boats? One ship. How many ships are owned by? How many freighter ships? What type of ship? Or oil ships? I, I think I think we have many. There is none oil ship owned by. That's, I know that. I already knew the answer. Yes. I want to ask you because I didn't see one. They uh they they said that they they probably might have some some more coming, but you know. Government, you remember they, when you said that they, you act, they act you something the truth. They don't tell you the truth. Yeah, but you, sometimes it's it's already there in front of your eyes. You just have to open your eyes and look at yep. it. Your remember when you said that you didn't know too. why Morocco and Libya gets paid more? Yes. Yeah. You don't have to be here in order to find the answer to that. All you have to do is go on the internet. Mm -hmm. And as I already know, and some of you guys already know, you remember they tried to pull Egypt and make it part of the Middle East? Mm -hmm. yeah. And you know the insurgencies where they're killing blacks in yes. the Sudan? Yes. And now it's divided. It's, the state is cut in half. Uh, same like Polisario in Morocco and the or so. In North Africa? Yeah, North Africa. In Morocco? Who think that they're white? I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. I think there's an invisible demarcation line mm -hmm. that starts across the Sahara. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Right? Oh, yes. Heavily influenced by. The north and the Arabs to the north. But now you know you know you know you know what you know you know what will be the problem because the French they know that Americans are on their eyes. Italian well, is the same. The same table, Spanish is the same. They know the that's why they go to the G eight they go to the G7. seven. Yes. And they don't tell you what they're doing. Sure yes. They're, they're eating out of the same pot. Yes. <laughs> that's true, you're right. The only thing they, they, they now make when you start <laughs> having your own meetings you leave them out and don't tell them what's going on, they might have a problem with that. Okay, for you guys, it's just think about investment. Yeah, yeah. But see, we're too transparent with them. I know three people. I know three people in Dakar that are looking for investment, investors like you. In what? In Dakar, here. In what? In everything. The link. They're, they're like a, it's like an association of investors here. If, you go see, if I take you see that guy, the guy knows some other people interesting about doing some other things. He's a central office, that guy. He's a friend of mine. They're looking for investors like you, someone who can invest their money to them, because them, they know the government people. So papers will be easy for you to get it from that guy. My concern is, I don't know nobody in this country, but I want to invest. I don't want to get ripped off. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm telling you this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm here for telling you what happened. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So all the people I know who already come here for investment, I took them to that guy. Yeah. And they're satisfied. The woman. They are? Yes. Because the guy will call some other people in his office well, yeah. and you're gonna to talk to them. What kind of money range are we talking about? Dollars, euros, CFAS. No. Range. Now, the, 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 30, 000, 30, 000, no, you're gonna tell them the range of money you can afford. Yeah, the rubber band thing. You yeah. will tell them. Yeah. You're thinking the rubber band. Yes. Yeah. Would you suggest having or employing someone that already lives here to help you navigate through yes. the business yes. it is that you're interested in? Yeah, but someone safe. That, and, and but that was paid. my next question. Yeah. Safe. Yes, someone safe. Someone that we're going because to introduce. We live really far. That's what I'm saying. Someone that we're going to introduce you to. Someone we know that having family, having house, and we know where to catch him if something happened. Mm -hmm. okay. A real. So we'll be the linking point between you and, and them. That's why I'm telling him that you can t take him to some people that we know we trust having big company if we and knowing know who he is. So if we have to, we can send family members from Southside South Chicago. To handle our business. <laughs> I know. I know, but let me tell, let, let me tell you something, brother. Listen, let me tell you something, brother. I know a lot of African American black people now doing business with Senegalese. I know yeah, we met many one of last them. Night. Yeah, yes. We met one last night. They, they need, they need, they need you. They need you. They need some people safe like you, clear like you, and they join. You join money together. My number one, my number, my number one things. I have two things. 
fishing and agriculture. But petrol is good, gas is good, but fishing, agriculture, and tourism. Yeah, fishing, tourism, and agriculture. Yes. Okay, but if you go to agriculture, you have to go and buy petrol. Yes. And that means one. Fifty to sixty miles away. Yes. Right. You have problems with the commute back and forth because of the road. And I know. Construction right yes. Is not bad. So yes. Losing but the government, the government making good roads now to get in this place quickly. They're making highway and toll road to reach those people, this place where you can have company. Do you have farmers willing to? Yes. Yes. Everything, crackers, machineries, crackers, everything. They need machineries. That's why the guy I'm telling you is interesting about that because I like the media. He will be the one that gonna link you and connect you, connect you with some people he knows I working. Like the media. Yes. I like the media. Yeah, I was trying to hear, yes. hear what you said. You said mercenaries or. You said you have a person that you know we could meet. Yes. Other a, than a, RJ. Yeah, a VIP guy that I know who knows any other people doing business. That and you're gonna you call them. Decide. Yes, and you're gonna decide which one, which one you can talk with, and, and, and which company you can open or which job you could do. Because they have an association of people. They can be maybe 30 people doing different things. Okay. But when you go to him, you tell him that I'm doing this, he knows, he knows. Quickly, the guy can connect you with. Okay, let me ask you something. Once, once I invest something, how long will it take to get my return? No, your your you, you, you return can, can you can get anytime, anytime, any, anytime that that thing like produce. You put some money in, you ain't gonna get no automatic. Yeah, but you got no, 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 you'll get, you'll get. You, you know, know I got an established Dow Jones market in the United States. They don't have that here. I understand. I'm just using that for example. Yeah, but I'm but not, but you I'm know, saying once you invest, say you went to a mutual fund, you ain't gonna get a dollar. You ain't gonna get your money just like that. It takes over time. To yes. Go. Yeah, but here you will according to the business you're doing. If the business go fast, quick, you got money quick. But really? But in certain industries, it's not like. No, the, the industry I'm telling you is very good. Agriculture, farming grounds, tourism. Like for example, let's talk about tourism. In tourism, if I introduce you to someone that renting cars now, you join your money together. The guy will buy a lot of buses, a lot of cars. The guy get a lot of link. You get money because every time when the tourists start again coming, we need buses, we need cars. So your money, your money will start coming. A lot of the old white when I was when we was coming back from the. Lake of the Pink. Yes. I saw a lot of old white buses. Transportation. Yes. I didn't see no new ones. No, those but are old ones. No, those are transportation for people, not for tourism. I don't uh, want to talk about. But still the one for tourism are SD. new and AC, AC bus and new bus. If I take it to a company named Seneca Tour, all the buses are new, brand new, 15 seats, 36, 60 seat bus. But Brown new. You, yeah, I got you what you're saying about that. But I'm just saying, okay, you lost some of your money. It's going to come from the people for bid. Of course, because your, 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 your embassy will be thrown in. Your embassy will know. Your embassy will know that you're here uh, and you are linking somebody. They will, they will, they will know. Okay. If something happens, you go to your embassy. All right. It depends on the industry that you decide to Yes, for example, for example, fabrics. Let's talk about, you know this kind of fabric? You call buzzing. Bazen. One meter of buzzing costs you twenty dollars. This one. One meter. I know some people they go to Germany, they go to England, they go to Austria to buy containers of these things. They come to the big store in Dakar, they sell them. People will buy this in my country every time because in my country the party we are organizing, like a naming ceremony or wedding or baptism, they wear this kind of fabric, men and women. In other words, you don't have nobody in this country making that fabric. We have now. They start now having, but not the same quality. How you get to that and it's still, is the question. It's still, it's still a reversal. Right. Yes. yes. Manufacturing plants of, yes. of resources. Kente cloth in Ghana gets produced in Europe. 
Really? And then they sell it back <laughs> to the gun and the gun ends. The gun ends. Oh, shit. Yeah. 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 Not all of it. I mean, that's the importance of yeah. manufacturing in Africa. Yeah. Made in Africa. Yeah. 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 Not all of it. Some of it you get in the village. That's right? why this whole economic paradigm that puts everything in the north and to the east, that puts them on top, it's got to get flipped in the favor of the African if you're going to win. Yes. You can't play by the usual rules. Okay, I'm going. I'm giving you this this one free. That's for investment. Okay, my eyes are not good for reading. Read well. You have everything inside there. So what should I do? You gonna make some copies? I sure can. We can go downstairs and do that. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't like I'm trying to do it, but no. I'm trying to grab all the money. No. 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 This guy is going with his cash. Right. He wants to spend it. Spend it. Spend it. Well, I like to see this guy you're talking about. To the show. Okay. I'm willing to invest. Yes. I'm willing to put my money into uh, uh, what's going on. Black, Pakistan, yes. Canadian, I mean, yes. Senegal. 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 We can do that tomorrow. He talks about tourism. All right. I said, I'm talking about infrastructure projects. You know, it's not a bus system. Yeah, yeah, right. You know, maintenance of roads and things like that. Like, God is having a problem with that. How do you transport goods and services on muddy roads if the roads are bad? Like, for example, listen. These are my richest papers that I have for myself. Starting business in Senegal. Starting a business or company in Senegal takes approximately eight days as compared to about 46 days for the sub saharan African region. These pieces outline the general technical procedures for starting a company in Senegal. According to the Doing Business Point of database by the World Bank, it includes details and requirements to be in good standing yes. with all relevant agencies Senegal. beyond the company register like social security agencies. Use this as a guide while you complete your pro the process and consult with agents carrying out work on your behalf. And you have additional notes maybe found here. Technical pro procedure here. So starting a foreign business in Senegal. His piece highlights issues for consideration when starting a foreign business in Senegal in four areas. Foreign business, access to industrial land, foreign ownership issues across sector, and commercial dispute arbitration. I'm going to give you all this. Okay? Mm -hmm. I'm going to give you all this free. You could copy. For example, Bomani will co could copy this to give any of you. That's the only copy right there? Yes. Yeah. But you can copy, you can copy it and give to whoever interested. Yeah. So we make sure we get a copy. Yes. Yeah, you can just give us a digital file. Or I'll make a copy. I'll take I'll take pictures of it. It's no big deal. I'm sure he has I'm sure he has it on a computer somehow we can get a digital file. I'd like and if nothing else, I'll scan it and I'll send it to everybody. You see this right. You don't mind using the price. I know, no problem. I'll take you know, one of the red wines. I'm feeling pretty good right now. This is my shit. I can't use this one at home. I gotta be like him. Alright, some more questions about the. Uh, so, family, anybody have any questions that we can come closer and then uh, just interact with our brother? Alright, thank you. <laughs> but, but definitely, brother, appreciate the, the overview of the, the last 50 well, something minutes of everything you've explained. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to, do you have a digital file of the information on your computer? Yes. yes. You can email me the information and I can get it on WhatsApp and I can email it to everyone else. Okay. All right. No. Yeah. And. I'm still. I do have a question for you. Uh, you touched on just citizens. come a little closer so we can hear the question because. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot you're recording. Excuse me. Yeah, if you can sit at any of these chairs, that'll be good. Excuse me. Excuse me. You talked about citizenship. Did you need that in order to participate in some of the business offerings? No, no, no. It's not by force. You need that. It's not by force. 
the citizen thing because is like if you want to live in Senegal, okay. if you decide to live in Senegal and you want to be Senegalese, but for, for business, you can still keep your nationality, like Americans. Uh, do you have, okay, so if you decide to participate in some of the offerings, do you have to um, in, uh, do it with a number of Senegalese, yeah, yeah. Have like in other countries? Yeah, in both, both ways, both ways. You can be Senegalese or you can be foreigners, both ways. Anyway. Oh, it's both ways? Okay. Yeah, both ways. Yeah, that's, pretty liberal. Man. That's, that's pretty good to know. That's both so ways. In some countries, you can't do anything. Yeah, you have to have to, like in, uh, in Tanzania. No, here, here, no, here, no. Right. No, here, no. Right. Here, no. But the most, the most important thing is, like, your, 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 your embassy should know that you're here for business. Understood. Yes, well, first. Our embassy. Your embassy. They should know. Our embassy. Yes, yeah, Susan yeah. is here in Senegal for this business. So they will control and follow her. Okay. In, in, in case that something happened. This? Uh, okay. What and, uh, area? I, I'm sorry. I have to ask a question. Ahead. What area would you suggest a person to do research in as far as agriculture? Okay. That wouldn't be in Good, the city of Dakar. Good question. That wouldn't be in the city of Dakar because you know why? The rainy season starts from June in my country and ends in October. Rainy wow. season. June? Yeah, June until October. Six months? Yes. It depends. Six months, but three months hardly raining. Right. You know what I mean? But if, yeah. if it's wet, we continue until October. But so, normally it's three months. So what's the main agricultural crop out here? Vegetables, rice, fruits, fruits, fruits like bananas, apples, strawberry, mangoes. You know, you have uh, you have uh, vegetables, olives, carrots, cassava, cabbage. Cool so a person can start an agribusiness out of it. Yes, mm -hmm. very important. Yeah. But he's still at the mercy yes. of shipping companies. Yes, but very important. Like, if you go outside of Dakar, like maybe maybe half an hour or one hour driving, that's where it's at. You see right. the farming grounds, things right. happening. It's, so, very, it's very green after yeah. the rain season, very green. I know, I'm just saying so that it's in, not in the initial stages of an agribusiness here, you know, in Africa moving to internalize and sharing its resources among all of its nations. I, I, I'm going back to infrastructure projects, so like truck drivers will have, have to be able to move oh, the fruits and vegetables to other no like, places like Ghana throughout the western coast. Yes. Right? But the, 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 yeah, the system in Ghana might be different to the system in Senegal because Ghana is English, Senegal is French. I know, but they have to, and that's why businessmen have to turn, attend certain meetings uh, put forth by the African Union. Yes. Because they're working toward a, a unified uh, a co commerce uh, cooperation between all African uh, countries. On yes, for, for example, myself, yeah. I'm looking for someone who can open a car company here. I said, okay. because a lot of two leaders want me to open my own car companies, bus companies, so I can work with them because I know them before and they trust me. But, but, but I, don't have, I don't have anybody behind me who can support me financially. Well, money. Would you, would you buy what kind of? Would you buy American cars, European cars, Nigerian? Any cars that any cars that are good for tourism. But Nigeria manufacturers. Nigeria, American, French, whatever. You could come here to your for tourism, though. Uh, invest your money in the things yeah. that, that, that take out money quickly. Right. Transportation is quick. Right. Agriculture, transportation, tourism. Like if you have a nice hotel like this in mm. the beach. Mm -hmm. It's full. Mm -hmm. You know this is Dakar. It's like official, uh, it's like something else. It's not. It's not like a beach club. But if you have what, a hotel like this, in the beach club, businesses? full. Okay, Joe, uh, since you're gonna enter, can you come along? No, no, no. It's okay. It's no, Nia's. It's Nia's. Uh, no, no. I mean, if you want to, no. no one is gonna hear your question because it's on. There's no microphone everywhere. Oh, okay. So, you I just got one last question. We'll try. No, take your time. Because no, you you're, you're really... Because I don't what want to what be businesses here that can, uh, can venture capitalists in, in Ghana uh, get subsidies from the, from the government of uh, Senegal to help pay for their projects? In Ghana? In the United States, if I start an infrastructure project, right, I can get tax breaks. Or, uh, or grants or things like that to help me to become successful. Are there any programs like that in Senegal? Yes. For new investments? Yes, that's why I said that I will take you to the 
Chamber of Commerce, the trade business center here. They'll give you more notes and more uh, opening ways for you to invest your money in any any company you want to be. I say we have to go to the chamber, of, the chamber of commerce. Then they need to know what you want to do. Okay. Like I'm telling you now what you want to do. Yeah. But I'm not the one offering. Because what I'm saying is you need to go see the government people. Yeah. Investors who are entrepreneurs, right? Yes. They always are looking to try to find a way in which they can subsidize their investment by being partnering by partnerships with the government, right? Yes. The government might take pay ten percent that they get back in the form of a rebate check to help them. Yes. Start for the, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but so. don't forget that we have some private people, not the government, right. that want to do business with you, private. But those private people, they know the way to take to get papers quickly also because they have been doing that for many years. Okay. Maybe the government will charge you more. What you're to say is you got a better opportunity yes. with the private. For the private. Than going with the government. Yes. You got more regulation. Yeah, more regulation, yes. The rules and stuff. Yes. Even, even the, the private, they know you get which way to take to get the regulation. Okay, that, that sounds good. I mean, because the things that, that, that means that things are yes. still wide open. Right. That's, right? There's yeah. more what leeway. Yeah. more. More yes, government. about import export. Oh, about she's acting good person. Money. About import export also, we have to go to the minister of trade, business, commerce in my country. They'll give you a big book. You open the book yeah, that's written in English and French, and you will see all the information necessary about importing or exporting. Is that a line for us to oh, yes. take advantage? Yes. Yes. But what do we export here? I told you just now that we export fruits. Salt, vegetables, wood, fabric, you know, rice and cotton. But for import, import machines, like you asked me, machines, cars, you pay more for? computers, uh, what else? Big, big, big machines for anything. We import them from, we import everything we don't have. Right. But whatever you have, we can export. Okay. Yes. Sir, you never said, when we asked about the rubber band dollar amount, you never gave, gave us any dollar amount. No, that I don't know, because you know what, I'm not involved into that. Go from what to what? Because I, I don't want to lie, to tell you something which is not true. And I'm they, they're taking my video, you know what I mean? But for that, the dollar she wanted amount, to know the what rubber band, the what could go it from? Be, does it cost 20000 does it cost 30000 Yeah, it depends. And I think for that, you get more information clear from your embassy. Because they won't lie to you. You sure? Of course. Question. They won't lie to you. They will, they will tell you the truth. The truth. Question. Yes. What did you say your expertise was? Did you say it was farming and fishing? Farming, fishing, tourism. Sure. Okay. But we have something else, like, 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 for example, car companies, you know? But I know, I know fishing is very good in my country because African people, they like fish. Fishing, fabric, tourism. Because, you know, Econ? Econ? Yes. Econ bought a lot of hectares of land in Senegal. After Sali, is about 3,000 hectares of land. He's making big buildings on the beach. He's making big hotels. Where about? Spend a lot of money. That's what they gave it to him. But I think, I think he, has, he has sponsor. Somebody gave him money from the U.S. They, they, they already start the work. They already start building. It's, it's about one hour, one hour from here. That's where it's, that's where this city is going to be. Yes. That's where Icon City is going to be. Yes, Icon City. It's not here in Dakar. It's not, it's not here in Dakar. Is he getting money from the Americans or is he getting it from the Chinese? I don't know. Something, some, someone is behind. I don't know who, but that, 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 that costs you a lot of money. Because they got a lot of money. A lot of money. That place is very yeah. wonderful. Right on the beach. Because it doesn't matter yeah. what Icon does. No, it doesn't. It matters. The investors are the ones who call the shots. Right. Because you're the ones that have to make them happen. There's many ways to be a slick, right? Right? Mm -hmm. Right? And the person who calls the shots is the boss. Yeah. You want to pull them this front. You know what I'm saying? They can put your face on it. Oh, say it. Sucker you into to believing into it and, and spending your money in it. Yeah. When the money's going the other way. Agreed. Yeah. Right? The top master. 
So you so um so for today your um business that you want to do uh and do is cars for tourists or automobiles? Car for car, car for tourists. Somebody sending me people from US. You know what I mean? When people get here, I'm organizing naming ceremony for big groups. Like I give them African names and tell them the meaning of their names. I have a band working for me, drummers and dancers. I told you that before. Yes, you did. I organize events. Like for example, Bowani can bring a group next time, big group. You can contact me before it comes. I make arrangements about everything. The ballet, the dancers, the drummers, and the naming ceremony in one hotel like this. My band will play. I take the microphone, I give you names one by one. And according how I look, I see you, I give you African names and I tell you the meaning of the name. Because I'm a storyteller. My grandfather alive until 120 years old before he died. Mm. 120. They give him they give me his name. You know, in my card, it says Papa. Papa and the name. Because Papa means junior. Like, whoever you see Papa. It means junior? That means junior, because they give you your grandfather's name. Wow. Like, my father named me to his father. That's why they put Papa first. So, my father used to be storyteller. My grandfather used to be storyteller, like a griot. Oh, yeah. So, we know how to dance. Wow. We know how to drum. We know how to do naming ceremony. You know the table. Yes. Now, naming ceremony is very important in Africa because mm -hmm. when the baby born, the naming is seven days after, like a week. I thought not cutting away from the system. No, no, like a week. We do it here a week. I thought it was what, what day you was born on. That That's was like the name. Ghana, I think. Yeah, that would That's be the God. name they give you. No, no, no. We don't, we don't do like a calendar name like the Catholics. We're Muslim. No, not Catholic. I'm just saying, most, I thought most Africans. If you were born on a Thursday, they had a certain name for that. No, no, no. Like if it's, if it's Thursday, they, they, they name it yeah. next Thursday. That's in Ghana. That's in Ghana. Yeah. I took my first name after the Ghanaian uh, Ghana tradition. Juno was born on Friday. Uh, but in Islam, it means something different. Uh, like for example, oh, okay. in this group, they, 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 they talk to me about Bani, Bani uh, 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 like a few weeks before he come. But if I know him before, I should have talked to him about naming ceremony. You're going to see my band here playing. Oh. And the dancers will dance, and I will name you one by one, like man name and woman name. Right. Because a week after you're born here, they name you. How we name you? The Imam is coming. Imam is the guy leading, leading the praise in the mosque. Mm. The Imam will come. The Imam of the village, the, the wise man of the village, my friends, my relatives, everybody come. They wear nice clothes like this in the morning. Earlier, like 8, 9 o'clock, we sit down down the floor on the maps. We recite some Quran because we're Muslim. We do some prayer first. And after, they call the father of the baby and ask him whose name we're going to give the baby. Like, you can name your baby here to your friend, to your father, to your mother, to your holy man, or to your neighborhood people. We don't use calendar here to name our baby. Our, as a Muslim, but Catholics are still doing that here in my country, Catholics. But here I can name my baby to Susan, or to Barney, or someone else. Okay. Now, the storyteller like me will stand up, the grill will stand up in the front of people and talk. We say something like to people, welcome them to the naming ceremony. And after, the father will, the father will, will tell me the name of the baby and I will announce it louder so everybody hear me. You know what I mean? But in the, in the same time they announced the, the baby name, they killed the goat. Because we're going to buy goat from the market. Yeah, like the blood? Yeah, the blood. We touch the blood just a little bit like this. Just for the baby to be well raised, to have education, to be okay, to be good. And we do some praise. Mm -hmm. Now, we're going to eat all day long. We eat the meat from the, the cow or from the goat we kill. In the morning, we eat like milk and cereals food we call it lach it's very good that's in the morning midday the ladies are cooking the goat one part of the meat the evening also we're gonna do another food from the same from the same cow meat and the men coming in the party give the men money the woman give the woman money just like a donation you know what i mean yeah yes 
and we're going to dance all day long. In America, they kill seven cows. They do? I know you had to be no. <laughs> You can't believe you're a thing. Come on, where you heard that from? I was like, yeah. I mean, how many folks you know got some cows? No. That's all in Chicago. I'm going to tell you something very. Listen. You are going to laugh. I'm going to tell you something important. You'd be surprised, maybe. In my country, if you marry a girl in Senegal, I don't know how because I don't know Ghana. I don't know Nigeria. But in Senegal, the girl should prove you that she's virgin. Come again? Come again? Yes. The, the, girl, the girl will prove you that she's virgin. How will she prove you? You have, you have to go to bed with her. There's a test for that? Yes. The men need to know. The family need to know. The people need to know if the girl was good or not. So who does the test? No, after the marriage. Oh, after marriage. Because we want our girl to preserve their virginity until they get married. Yes. So who does the test? No. The man would like to bed with her. The what? Like if I marry your girl. Now listen, 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 let, let me tell them clear. If I marry your girl, you give me your girl, same age to me, I marry her. In the evening, she should prove me that she's virgin. I need to know. You go to bed. Right, and she's not. Yeah, you got a passport. That's too easy. No, 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 no. That's African ways. No, it's not. It's not. That's good for the girls to be no, well not. done before they get married. Now, how we do that? Let me tell you. How we do that? No, is that clear? How you do that? So, yeah, because she don't want to listen to me. I know. She's running everywhere. Yeah. Don't worry. If I marry, I won't ask you, Virgin. I won't ask you that to prove me because I know. I won't ask you if I marry you. I'm saying a girl, that's what I'm saying. He says easy, no. He said a girl, he said you. Now, <laughs> after the wedding, yeah. listen, listen to me, Susanna. I'm going to you. <laughs> after the wedding day, like in the evening, the guy come in the house late in the evening by one o'clock. Mm -hmm. The girl will wait for her in the room. What's up, Ivy? But she's going to have a witness. But the witness yeah. will be not in the room. The witness will be waiting outside. You got to be certified. The guy will come upon the door. While the girl she's lying on the bed, they couldn't talk, play together, and the guy tried try to have sex with her. If she's okay. This is not the guy that's gonna marry her. This is somebody else. No, no, the guy will marry her. Yeah. Okay. It's a test. The, 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 the husband. Okay. Now, for example, they get have sex in the evening. Early in the morning, the guy will go. Now, the witness lady opened the door, check if the girl was bleeding first. If the hymen was broken. Yes. But right. they know first blood or real blood. First blood. Because the lady will, the, those blood. ladies are specially witnesses yeah, for them. They will touch and know. They know. Yes. <laughs> That's Africa. Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, <laughs> where, where are you going? Yes, because so you all do that to women. Yes, no, 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 finish now. Because no more women. I thought that was, that no was more. That's we finish now, no yeah, more. Yeah, if the police see you, no, if, listen, yeah. if the government see you do that, listen to me. If the, 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 the government know that you are doing that for ladies, for girls, they put you in jail. You stay in jail 15 years now. It's really? signed now. Yeah. No more girls. That was a but the boys is okay. We can still do that, boys. But no girls because okay. many girls die because yeah. of injection. That was terrible. Right. But I, 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 I appreciate that tradition. I, I appreciate that tradition. But I um, appreciate what? women's circumcision. No, when I was, is that what y'all talking about? Yes. I thought was talking about. Girl. No, I thought we were talking about. No, no, we over, we over. Okay, okay. okay. I, I okay. still want to wait. No, we take that before. We said that before oh, they asked me this okay. question. I, I think I understand now. I understand what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. I, I okay, mean, because I remember, I remember three years ago when I'm, when an American lady wanted to marry me. She came here twice. She went to my family. She said that she wanted to marry me. But my mother would like to know if she was virgin or not. Because here, about traditional speaking, your mother would like you to marry someone virgin. Exactly. 
Oh, yeah. wow. That's, that's, that's what that's they want. That's but since they know that, they know. No, listen, they know that I'm into tourism. I can marry someone who's not virgin. Fresh. We can talk together like this yes. and make arrangements. Praise the Lord. How many? How many wives do you have? In my country, you can have more than four wives if you can afford them. Yes. If you can afford them. A responsibility. Yes. If you can afford them. You, you, you spend two nights here, two nights here, two nights here, two nights here. <laughs> You know, and the you know, wife is the boss. The freeway. No, first no, wife no. is the boss. Yeah, no. the, the first wife, that's where you spend the night first. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, same number of days. Not, not, not one more day. Not like you, you have to you put have them to equals equally. them. You have to two nights here, two nights, two nights, two nights. But wherever you spend the night, she's the one cooking. She's the one cleaning the house. She's the one uh, making baths to the kids. She's the one controlling the house. Like if you move to another room, there will be a turn to do, to do the same thing. Going to the market, cooking. My father used to have three wives before he died. My mother was the second one. But I grew up in one family that I have seen my my other father's wife in the, in the same family. So I would like when I, when I grow, I would like to have the same thing like my father, having three wives. It's normal. That's why when your father died, we share things now. I come back to what I said before because we get different wives. In one family. Wouldn't it be easier if you had like two at a time? <laughs> yeah, yes. But still, it's still you can afford them. You have to afford yeah. those, those women. Yeah, but you can do that in God. So I don't understand why, why you laughing. No, I'm saying two at a time because he was saying one here, one here. Yeah, you can marry two at a time. No, no, no. Two in the same night. No. Oh, actually. I don't know. He's talking about the other one. Yeah, he's talking about the other one. That's what he's talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah with the proof that the bride was a virgin. To tell the public? The, yes. <laughs> and it has like a, red, a, 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 a stain on it or whatever. It's, 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 so I'm familiar with it. I just was confused as to how you, but I got it now. Mm -hmm. But back to, the, we can talk about that on that. Back to the investment. What I, what I wanted to know about, you said you don't have to have a partner to invest. You won't have to have a, 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 a single knees partner. Yes. You, you, I have to. Yes. I for have you, to have For a, you to grow money, you are, you are, you are, you can, it's better for you to have a Senegalese, Senegalese partner. But if you don't have a partner, you invest yourself. You're going to invest yourself to do to get your own company. Mm, yes. No, in any ways it's possibility possibility. You invest your own money for yourself or you have a partner. But now the, the, the benefit is like your partner is here while you are in the US. You know what I mean? And yeah. you can work together. Right. And then your language barrier. Yes. Yeah. You need someone to translate. Yeah, you need someone. Yeah. You need a translator, you need someone who is bringing your partner, someone control things. Right. You know, send me text you message every time. So you just need to know what the dominant language is. Everybody yeah, speaks French, right? And Wolof, the local right. language. Voila. The average single, uh, a person from the Senegal can speak up to four different languages. Right? Yes. He right? speaks like Yeah, but it, it, me, I speak four. But you might see some people speak only one in yeah. their life. Now, I know it's sad to come into Senegal and, and mastering French as a colonial language. But at the same time, that person, if he's going to be in business here, Wolof is the second dominant, dominant language? Yes. So Wolof is the first, after French. Yeah, so French is official from schools. So those two languages... Yes, those are the main two men. But now English is coming now, because we have a lot of English people coming. Yeah. Okay, let me actually now, after French, that's English. And English is, is international. Everywhere you go... So what's your estimation that English will take a, a place as a language of commerce mm. in this part of the world. Yes. Is it five to yes. ten years from now? No, yes. French is, English is very important now around the world. Yeah. Very important everywhere English you go. English is just, a, like I said, it's just a language of commerce. Yes. Of money. Of Money and business. Business. I agree. Right. 
you know. And even those people who are doing dealing in English on the on the uh, African continent as as well as other places have to be careful with that. Like for example, because within the context of speaking a different language, there can be uh, a confusion of cultural communication. Like for example, him is that some investment. I can introduce you to three people I know that owning hotels in Sali, in the beach area. The hotels are totally destroyed, getting old. Yeah. And they need, they need someone to finance the money for the hotel to be renewed on the beach. They're looking for an investor like you, uh -huh. the big boss, big director. They need some money. If you see them, you talk to them, they, tell you, they estimate you money you should give them. They show you the rooms and everything. You see the like of the hotel, everything. You might do business with them. Okay. The, the hotels on the beach, but getting yeah. old and no people yeah, coming in. Yeah. They need to renew the hotels. So meaning as a contractor, you have to have a supply chain for parts and Ooh. expertise and labor in order to, because some of the restaurants that we went into, they were like, uh, you know, way under par to promote a, uh, well, this, this, is where this is where America know how. Excuse me, go on. Yeah, that's where it comes from. And that's the one thing that, that's unspoken when they talk about African Americans is that not only were we raised in the belly of the beast, but we're in a strategic position to take advantage yeah, of opportunities so because we works. have access to the education. Works. Right, works. right. Works. advanced education in the West. Like, he drives a truck, but when he, I'm sorry I keep using you, brother, but you are an example. So, so family, we're going to cut this uh, cut this feed, and we just hope that uh, you got some good so information, and this uh, you can send us a message, and we'll connect you with any of our brothers and sisters uh, in Senegal, and Dahuda is available. Uh, so just uh, send a message, communicate, and uh, we'll connect you. Or even how to clean up a hazmat spill. That's true. Right? And that's something very necessary. Right. Yeah. So what well, he brings to the table when they start pumping could that could make him part of a transportation system. Yeah, well they're gonna stop pumping that white gas. Time, right? that's that's all, he's gonna be they're go. gonna be he's gonna there be a go. vital man. That's right. That's right. So brother, how much yeah. were you looking to raise for your particular business and transportation? Oh uh, uh, tourist transportation. Normally if we start if I start with uh, two van, like 15 six van with AC brand new, two van, two small car, mm -hmm. you can get money. No, what would on, be the investment, initial investment in that? Money, only money. You buy the car here. No, she's talking about the how amount. How much? Man. Like the number of money. How much money? Well, no, but I, I, I don't know how much in dollars, but in safer, normally, in safer, if you have like a, like a, the, if you have like 20 million CIFA, 20 million CIFAs. I don't know what that is. How much is, is that in America? It's about, uh, it you, you, you divide it by 500. Put it yeah, on divide it by 500. Let me, yeah, let me get that right quick, please. Yes. 200 million CIFA. No, 20 million CIFA. Divide it by 500. Oh, wow. You got it? No. Oh, okay. My stuff's in there. Did you do it, Junior? I gotta tell, find my calculator. Yes, yeah, yeah, so 20 million so CIFA. Like 20? Did he say 20 million? That should, that should be a million US. Or maybe I'm off. I think you're too high. 20 so million. You do, 20 million CIFA. You do 20 and 6 zero. 20 I ain't plus, got it. 20 plus 6 zero. 20 plus 6 zero divided by 500. You could have like two vines and two cars. With 20 million safer? Yes, and you open your office, like you, you, buy, you buy computers, you find a secretary, everything, you know, you can start your job. They rent your car every day. Right. Every day they rent you. No, you do 20 plus 6 zero. No, 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 I, 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 I need the calculator to do it. I don't know if you can do 20 million. Right? Yeah. 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 Because I can't add any more zeros here. Oh, okay. Switch. Because that's about four hundred thousand dollars, maybe. No, that's too. That's too much. That's still too high. I think it's more like a hundred thousand. 
Twenty-two billion seen for? Twenty. So yeah. four hundred dollars. No, that can't be right. Yeah, yeah, Twenty million. Twenty two billion. Twenty-two thousand SIFA. No, twenty. But he said twenty-two million. No, twenty million. So twenty million. That that do twenty plus six zero. Twenty. Oh, no, that's a lot. I think, I think uh, he's right. I think it's a hundred and twenty million. Hundred and twenty thousand. Maybe. For two vans, two cars, an office, a 20, secretary. Twenty thousand. <laughs> because what? Because one thousand dollars. Two hundred and twenty. Yeah, because one thousand dollars is five hundred thousand cifa. Right. One hundred. One thousand dollars means five five hundred thousand. Yeah. Because that's what I thought, and I know that was too high. How many investors are you looking for? No, if I have one or two, one or two is okay. Is there a starting point or did it just it, it, you can get into any numbers? Oh, no, no, any numbers, any number. Okay, they can start, you can start any numbers this, this year, maybe next year. But I know that twist will be up on it. But you, can, you can't do anything without looking at a prospectus report. You know, you'd have to. There's a lot it's of things to take into consideration before that money crosses that table, right? And it's all got to be on paper. It's a, a perspective report is a look at future earnings, you know what I'm saying, based mm -hmm. on current trends. Yes. It's based on a lot of things. Now, if he can draw up that kind of report, right, based yeah, on real time in, in the future, yeah, it's look worth right. looking at. But if he can't, it's not worth looking at. I disagree on that. Yeah, because really all you need is just a business. No, no, you, yeah. you get money. Yeah, I mean, you're trying to get the future. So you got the business plan and gather, right? Well, I mean, what's the future? Is it five years? Is it ten years? What is it? Well, listen to what I'm trying to say. He's seeing that the future is not five years. It's not five years. It's not five years. He sees it's a need now. Right. Based off of the development that we see. Yeah. Uh-huh. Not something going to, you know, it's going to grow eventually anyway. Yeah, but when you talk about investment, you're talking about getting a return over time, right? True. Yeah, it's not going to be immediate. It's oh, right. Yeah. All that's what the perspective report is based on. You're dealing dope. <laughs> that's just bottom line. But 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 talking about all right, all right, all right, let's go with that. Yeah. If I buy a a, a a kilo of of you know what I'm talking about, right? Right. And then I put so many out there on the street. street. I expect a certain amount of return over a certain amount of time, right? In a, in a mile days, days or whatever. A perspective report is a report based on the same time. But period. I think I think in the tourism, the result might be immediate in the tourism because yeah, because you're you're gambling with your investment. Oh, all so investments. Every, before you commit, that's what your name on yeah. the dollar yeah. line. Yeah. So you heard me yeah. all every investment is gambling. Right. So, yeah. Basically, what he really needs to do is just come yeah, up with. So you try to minimize the yeah, risk. Yeah, yeah, plan. yeah. You need to come up with a business plan, right? Thing. With a mission uh, statement. The business right. plan is, yeah, the mission statement, yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Business plan and mission statement. And then if he, if and he, then, if he that, wants that to be way a, you a have, complete partner, yeah. Maybe he can put up some type of collateral if he can't put cash up. Right. Because and, even and if land, sometimes he has land, if he can't meet his end of the bargain. Then he buys into a certain amount of the, of the risk. That yeah. means he can be yeah, so bought out or sued. If he got, he said agriculture. So if he has land, then maybe he can put the land up for as a major investor. Yeah. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Collateral. That, that, that's because right, he's got the land. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He, he said he had. Well, he mean he could go get land and then put that. Up. You're right. It's whatever the, each each person brings to the table. Yeah. He yeah. might bring cash. Because if he brings the knowledge has, and the language right. mm -hmm. and the land, yeah. he bring the money. Right. You don't necessarily need a yeah, perspective. Workers have to be. <laughs> you don't need a perspective. Yeah. That's silly. No. Power cut. Yeah. But we know we we experience tourism first, ourselves, first so we know this right. money just is. paying bills right. the first year sometimes. Well, he said, yeah. sometimes bills. Well, my man said, saying, saying you know, if you invest you just now bills. in something, two months down the road, you getting your money back, yeah. or a good portion of your money back. Yeah, I think that's a win-win to me. Workers got to be paid. Yeah, that's true. And what is the average? Uh, do they have hourly wage out here, or do they have Eggy. month monthly wage, or do they have weekly wage? 
Eh, chi? Sara? Sono? 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 No, you only go one of your minor houses for Bunny Barrett, Bunny Barrett. Okay, I found it. You need Nanny for five or 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 five so they say well, that the, the average working person. No, 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 girl. No, 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 Forty thousand dollars. Forty thousand. Okay, I did something wrong. I got forty thousand. Forty thousand, ain't bad. Damn. Hmm. I'm not sure. I didn't pass. <laughs> 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 That's all we get, like. What did he just see? He said it was a C or an X. Uh, C F A. With the X. C C. No S C. C F A. Now X O F. Financial African Community. Financial African Community. CFA no. means Financial oh. African Community. <laughs> so, so what hey, is it? Uh, 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 all the way down. How long will that be? How long will that be? How long will that be? No, they give you money every year. You have to be agreed in what number of money you want. They give you that money every year. They will give it in a year. That's up to you to tell them. How y'all want it. Yes. The tournament business. Really? Which? On a quarterly basis and stuff no, like that. Right? Yes. No, at all. So, so, no, so, no, no. I need to read the talk. I need to outside of the talk. Give her the talk. I gotta go to the bathroom. And you can go to the bathroom here. And the canvas. Italy. She expresses herself in a different fashion, right? Spain, Morocco, what's wrong? Florence, she's, Venice, already, she makes she's a costume designer. Yeah. That's what I mean. And you can yeah, see what they call it, what we call a pool crowd. So we could use her for to yeah. for political yeah. activities. Yeah. Mr. Ring luxury trip. Oh, yeah. Right there, on your left. On your left. Sports, hotels, uh, salons. Uh, you know, to draw the environment and to make pressure. Oh, that, that's good. I have your business. I have two. I have two. Yeah. No, character trips. Some of these trips, you know, like me. Very good. Yeah. You know, oh, very good. Yeah. Yeah. Thousands yeah. for 10 days. During Adolf Hitler's yeah. reign, like Adolf Hitler used to draw yeah. caricatures, yeah. negative caricatures of Germany got a train in order to get the German people to buy into his terror. You so politically, money, economically, and Senegal, you we can use one your of my, uh, skills in order to draw. One of my brothers is here. He has uh, some clothes to, to show them. He's asking me if you can come here and show them the clothes. Uh, I'd like to see him. Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you for money. That's how that's how I get the squeeze out your soul. I always find him and I'm like, I'm like, move on, walk us through this. Well, I don't think they have to have a family. We're going to cut the feed for real. We really appreciate our brother and it's going to all of this stuff. But now we gotta close. I should say. No, I don't know. That's very powerful.